What's up guys, welcome to World of Concrete 2022. We're here at Somro with Guy, and he's gonna walk us through the SRS4 laser screen. Yeah, so one of our uh, more uh, mobile uh, boom machine, we came to the market with it about two years ago. I mean, uh, you know, size-wise, it's, it's a great size for, for doing smaller jobs, but also bigger jobs for, for a boom machine. The machine is really made for um, a, a whole bunch of different applications. Um, I see it on ag work, we see it on a bigger uh, industrial floor, and also on smaller uh, smaller slabs, because it's, you know, it's easy to move around. We got crab steering, we got two-wheel steer, and we got uh, four-wheel steers to get around the job site and around protrusions or columns uh, that are on the floor. So it, 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 it is equipped to do different applications. Okay. You, you talk about this uh, being a more versatile machine. Where would you say someone maybe look more towards this machine versus like maybe a 485 or a copperhead? What amount of square footage are we looking at to where they might want to lean more towards this? Yeah, so you really want, depending on, on how the job is set up, but anywhere from the, the eight to 10,000 square foot uh, job to, you know, probably 20 to 30,000 square foot job a day, um, you, you can do it with this 18 foot boom, 10 foot head. So you're doing a, a decent amount of square footage per pass. It has you know the auger so it discharges to the right so we always have to screed left to right but the auger also helps with a stiffer slump and pushing the, the aggregate down um, into the concrete it's fixed vibrator and uh, you have the plow so a Kubota diesel engine um, that's able to pull the mud even on, uh, on a hotter day when it gets a little stiffer uh, but it's really easy to drive around the job site as well. It's remote control, so the operator has everything in his hands and it can be, you know, as far as the boom can reach or it can be right by the machine when he's screening. Visibility underneath the machine and around is, is really good, so um, make it makes it a safe machine as well. There's uh, optional accessories on the machine that we're gonna go through that makes it customizable. Let's kind of go over some of the accessories that we can load these machines up with. Yeah, so the, the SRS can be customized to uh, any uh, budgets and needs for the customer. First one is the storage compartment. It's very uh, convenient to have. You can store your receivers or, you know, your owner's manual, anything uh, that's, you know, useful on a job site. Obviously, you see the remote here. The machine is remote control, um, very uh, intuitive remote. There's several um, buttons on it, but it's all being easy to operate, even on the coldest day, even if you have gloves. It's a remote that's pretty intuitive and easy to operate. The next accessory um, that's optional is the pressure washer. Very uh, useful on a job. Usually, you know, the machine will be uh, pretty dirty at the end of a pour. So now you, you just have to get water feed to, to the pressure washer and pressurize itself, and you're ready to clean. Um, taking, you know, you don't have to carry a separate pressure washer on your job, so saving some room in your trailer. Oh, yeah. uh, it's all mount on the on the machine. Um, and then the last one is the uh, operator platform seat. Um, you know, you, you, most people will want to run the screen standing up, but on long days or when you're doing 3D, it's nice to go and sit down and get a little bit of a rest uh, when you've been, you know, screening for a few hours. Um, and lastly, I'll mention, uh, just like any of our machines, uh, our screen is 3D ready with the software license. So guys, that's the SRS4 from Somro. Thank you, Guy, for Welcome. going over this machine with us. Guys, we have these machines in stock. We're constantly doing demos with them. We'll also have these at our demo day this year, June of 2022.